As my mother would say, what a tangled web we weave yes. when we practice to <laughs> deceive. It's all getting so complicated it is now. It's so complicated and so complex. Layla's her bestest friend in the whole world, her only friend. And this is what she's done. Why would she do that? Because Layla has been so good to her. Yeah. And she's her husband been through her left. troubles. She's yes. had a moment, a moment of weakness. <laughs> Can happen to anyone? Well, I think that's it. You know, not that there's any excuse. But um, Priya has been with Rakesh a long time and stood by him. And he hasn't been the greatest husband. Quite right. And, um, exactly. Yes. And, um, and she hasn't been thinking about Layla through this, and I think it just, it was a wrong time, wrong place, and she was in a state, she went over to see her best friend, and her best friend wasn't there, but Pete was there. And what's Pete's excuse? He'd had an argument with Layla that day, and it was all going wrong, and I think we both had felt a little bit, um, just not, you know, I think Priya had not felt herself since being with her husband, and he hadn't quite felt himself, and I think they just thought, oh, let's just, yeah, and, go and for it. regrets now? Are they having regrets now? Yeah, huge regrets. I think now what happens after the whole passionate thing is her the realisation of what is actually happening. Yes, and is that what's actually happening? Is she with child? <laughs> well, I can say that we're going to have to wait and see, but uh -huh. possibly. Possibly, yes. And I think that's where her feelings are going to start to come into play because she realises, oh my goodness, I might be a single mum again and is yes, he going to go back to Layla? You know, so... So the thing is, do you confess? Should she confess? Well, she's threatening to, and she might. You know, Priya's got a heart and she loves Layla, and I think she's now starting to realise that this has just got very complex and complicated. How am I going to get out of this? And she wants to do the right thing, she really does, but um, somehow, you know, and it is but she so, seems to be so. getting a little bit jealous now that, that Pete's, you know, declared loving Layla, and yeah. she seems to feel... Originally, she would have been happy for them, wouldn't she? But Absolutely, now, yes. Now, do you think she's feeling a bit more for Pete than we think, that it's more than just a one-night stand? Well, they've been together a couple of times now, so it's not just been the once. Mm -hmm. So I think, yes, some, some emotions probably are getting involved. See, that's what she's a woman, saying, after all. <laughs> so I'm told, so I'm told. Um, yes. Fiona, what about the whole journey to get to Emmerdale and being in Emmerdale and being the centre of uh, big plots like this and whatever? I mean, you've served your time, you've done your apprenticeship, and um, if, if required, you could dance your way into any show, couldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> What are you saying? What, dancing? Yeah, is that... On dance oh, dance, yeah. Yeah. thank you. Yes, well, you know, that was just a great thing to go off and do. I had a tiny little break and it was just a new experience and um, I have danced before. You know, I used to do West End shows and things like that. So it was just nice to work with some incredible choreographers and people. It was brilliant. And this is your first kind of soap, isn't it? Or serial drama. Yes, but, yeah. yes. And, uh, but being in Emma Darling, it's fantastic. The show's just brilliant right now and it's just great to be a part of. So you know what's coming. Um, were you shocked when you read the scripts, how this storyline is going to unfold? Because I would imagine Layla will be quite kind of want her revenge if and oh, when yes. she finds out. No, definitely. And, you know, the producer told me this is what was going to happen. And, you know, as an actress, you just want to play the drama and it's just fantastic to have the, a great storyline. Um, but also it's a storyline, correct me if I'm wrong, that you've drawn on from your own experiences, this, this Pete mm -hmm. and uh, Priya story, is it not? Well, you know, um, obviously I'm on the other side. I'm the person that, well, she's not cheating because she's not with her husband anymore, but, you know, she's yeah. being sort of the person that her best yeah. friend's partner is cheating with. Um, so obviously I can't draw from that as such, but, you know, we've all been there. We've all been hurt, haven't we? We all know what it feels we like. had a broken heart. Yes, absolutely. So um, Your best friend's I husband. Know. <laughs> I know. It's just the worst. Awful. The Couldn't worst. imagine. But, um... But it's drama and it's great to play and me and Roxy and Anthony, we, you know, it's, it's fun, so it's good. Well, we will watch with interest. Seven o'clock tonight. Thank Seven o'clock so tonight, much. ITV. <laughs> uh, say hi to everyone up at Emmerdale. We love them all. Thank it's good you to see you.